What is up guys? Today I finally had luck at Starbucks and I was able to order the turkey pesto panini. It basically has roasted red peppers with pesto spread and then turkey breast on a shabata type of bread and I'm excited because I've tried to come get it like four times. One time I placed my order but I forgot to ask about it and then the other two times was that I was in a store that had it out of stock and then one more time <laughs> I had gone to a store that had it but apparently I was checking out at the same time as someone else and that person might have beat me by like a second because the app ended up crashing and when I came back to the site after I had added my item to the bag it had red letters saying that it sold out and I'm like the level of fuckery is just unbelievable this is what it looks like it has a little hole there it collapsed some but anyway it looks like a hot pocket kind of <laughs> pretty interesting so yeah, let's just dig in. I'm excited. I love pesto. It is so good. So the bread, as it is very characteristic of shabara, it's soft. Like you can press it and, and it's soft in the middle and it's a little toasted on the outside, but perfect, perfect texture. The turkey itself, it tastes really good. Good temperature. It tastes like actual turkey breast. There's nothing bland about it. It's not too salty either. And it is moist. The pesto itself, very good. Very rich. Now, the roasted bell peppers, red peppers, I see it. But I guess none of the previous bites had any pepper in it because I haven't tasted it yet okay it gives it a little kick and then of course there's the cheese i believe this is provolone that little white stuff i would have to check the menu because i don't tend to be very good identifying cheeses <laughs> by name but yeah you guys this tastes exactly like what i expected and hoped for it reminds me of the chicken and pesto pizza that i eat but the only difference is that instead of chicken, I have turkey and it has red peppers, which I usually don't order in my pizza. Now, not that this needs any doctoring, but if I were to enhance it just a little, 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 little bit, I would probably add onions. But this, the way it is provided, is good. So I really feel like adding onions would be to make it heartier than it already is and perhaps i would also add a hint of black pepper because when it comes to deli meats i like to have black pepper on it i don't care what it is cracked black pepper is the way to go all right guys well thanks so much for tuning in have you had something like this or have you had this very thing let me know how do you feel about pesto? Are you a big fan of pesto? Anything with pesto, I gotta try it. And that's the reason I'm trying this thing. I had no intention of trying it until I was at the drive-thru and I happened to be just staring at the horizon and then I skimmed the menu items that they have on the poster even though I knew what I wanted. And then I saw this thing and I said, wow, I'm going to take a break. From the impossible sandwich and get this instead the price wasn't so bad it was like six something it's definitely filling it's a good size and the ingredients are good so i will very gladly pay for that as many times as i want need or desire all right guys well thanks so much for tuning in and i will see you soon